Hello everyone. Today, we're exploring the medication known as Eucerus, with its generic name being Budesonide. As always, our discussion is for educational purposes. Should you have any health-related questions or concerns, it's essential to consult a medical professional. Description Eucerus is an extended-release corticosteroid tablet designed to reduce inflammation within the body. It is primarily prescribed to help control active, mild to moderate ulcerative colitis, UC, in adults, aiming to induce remission. The safety and effectiveness of Eucerus extended-release tablets in children have not been established. Warnings When on Eucerus, it's crucial to avoid proximity to individuals who are ill or have infections. If exposed to chickenpox or measles, contact your doctor for preventive treatment. These conditions can be severe or even fatal for those using Eucerus. Signs of excessive corticosteroid in the body include thinning skin, easy bruising, changes in body fat distribution, increased acne or facial hair, menstrual irregularities, impotence, or decreased sexual interest. Always follow the directions on your medicine label and inform all your healthcare providers about your medical conditions, allergies, and medications. Before taking this medicine, Eucerus should not be taken if you are allergic to budesonide or any of its ingredients. Before starting Eucerus, inform your doctor if you have had tuberculosis. Any bacterial, viral, fungal, or parasitic infections, especially chickenpox or measles. High blood pressure. A weakened immune system. Osteoporosis or low bone mineral density. Stomach ulcers. Eczema. Any surgeries planned. Allergies. Diabetes, cataracts, or glaucoma, either personally or in family history. Liver disease. Steroids can weaken the immune system, making infections easier to contract or exacerbating existing ones. If you've had any illness or infection in the past few weeks, inform your doctor. Also, discuss with your healthcare provider if you are pregnant, planning to become pregnant, breastfeeding, or planning to breastfeed. Dosage Eucerus should be taken as prescribed by your doctor. Typically, the adult dose for ulcerative colitis is 9 mg orally once a day in the morning for up to 8 weeks. It's essential to avoid grapefruit juice during this treatment. The tablet should be swallowed whole without crushing, breaking, or dissolving. If you've been on Eucerus long term, you might need regular medical tests. Always store the medication in a tightly closed container at room temperature, away from moisture and heat. Side effects Like all medications, Eucerus can have side effects. Some common side effects include headache, dizziness, indigestion, nausea, vomiting, stomach pain, bloating, gas, tiredness, high blood pressure, back pain, muscle cramps, joint pain, swelling of the face and lower extremities, pain during urination, acne, increased body and facial hair, cold symptoms like stuffy nose, sneezing, sore throat, and decreased adrenal gland hormones. If you notice any unusual symptoms or side effects, it's crucial to consult your doctor. Interactions Eucerus can interact with other medications. It's vital to inform your doctor about all medications, supplements, and herbal products you're currently taking. Specifically, stomach acid reducers might interact with Eucerus. However, this list isn't exhaustive, and other drugs might also interact with budesonide. Avoid While on Eucerus, it's recommended to avoid grapefruit products due to potential interactions. Additionally, steer clear of people who are sick or have infections. If exposed to chickenpox or measles, seek preventive treatment. FAQ a common question about Eucerus is its suitability for children. Currently, the safety and effectiveness of Eucerus extended-release tablets in individuals younger than 18 are not well established. Always consult with a healthcare provider for any specific queries related to this medication. Closing That concludes our overview of Eucerus. Remember, this information is intended for educational purposes and should not replace professional medical advice. Always consult with a healthcare provider for any questions or concerns. Thank you for joining us.